Hey oh. guys! Oh, let's see if it's working. Let's oh, see if they can, uh, can here spot we go. us. It's a nice shirt, by the way. Oh, yeah. You should have told me you were going to wear that one. Now we're... That's all awfully coordinated. I feel embarrassed. <laughs> hey, cool. I'm actually somewhat transparent. So, oh yeah, your arms are... Uh, I'm see ghostly. Chat, we need you to tell us if this is working. Oh, it is working. All right, they can see <laughs> us. Awesome. What's up, guys? Hey! Um, my name's Aaron. Work here at Sega. I'm Gene, the intern. Also known as Sergio. Yep. He's uh, He's been assisting me with all the dank memes that you guys have been enjoying for the last X months. It's been a while now. Yeah, it's here, been right? a while. Yeah. So this is our kind of our test room today. Um, we are hoping in the future maybe to do something a little more regular um, with you guys to try and offer you a kind of a look behind the scenes here at Sega, um, here in the Sonic office, at what we kind of do with some of the work that goes into the games that are coming up, mm -hmm. and maybe looking at some of those games that we're also um, getting to work on and see on a daily basis, Absolutely. which is pretty cool. Um, so this is our test. So please bear with us. Hopefully there's yes. no loud buzzing noise right now. Uh, no, no, that, that's okay. okay. Bad, bad, bad flashback. Don't, <laughs> don't do that to me, man. Um, so hopefully everything's good. There might be some technical problems, so please bear with us. This is kind of the first stream to get things running. Um, and We weren't actually going to announce it. This was just going to be a surprise stream. Mm -hmm. And then a certain someone, I guess went out and leaked that, that this was going to be a stream today. I wonder uh, who, could, who leaking? I what? Someone at Sega leaking something? I, I don't, don't know. <laughs> I don't know who could have done that. Who? So I don't know. So um, today we've got some cool stuff. We're going to kind of actually show you first, if you haven't already seen it, the infomercial that we made for the Sonic Mania Collector's Edition, um, which we're, we're pretty excited for. Mm -hmm. um, we filmed it last week. Um, we, we worked with our friends over at Eisenberg and put yep. this together. And, and those guys are awesome. And um, you guys probably saw the picture of the eggs that I tweeted out, some of you. Um, now you know what those were for, and and the best part is we'll talk about it once we let's let's watch it once, and then I'll tell you guys some kind of behind the scenes stuff about mm. that video that you don't know. Watching some stuff, I don't know if we can do that. Can we do it? Maybe. Uh, what is going on here? I know. We're blurry. Thank you. Yes. Hello, random person from we're the blurry. office. Blurry. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Good to know. We we have someone has just opened the door and told us we're blurry. Yeah, we are really blurry. Apparently, it's pretty bad. Okay. We'll uh, we'll work on that. Thanks, ah. guys. Cool. Okay. We're yeah, gonna go yeah. ahead. <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and uh, and play this for you guys, and attempt to get ourselves a little less blurry as we go through this. Like I said, yep. it's the first one. Test so. run. Hey. All right. Can you get us going? Yes, I can. All right, Mr. Sergio. I leave it to you. That should be playing, maybe. Now, when you there we go. The Sonic Mania Collector's Edition, you get the Sonic Mania Collector's Edition statue absolutely free. Alone on a Friday <laughs> night? No problem. Sonic Mania Collector's Edition handles stubborn stains. It even comes with a gold ring for that special someone in your life. She said yes. Congrats, you two. But wait, it comes with a game, too. To get Sonic Mania, just log on to the World Wide Web, download, and play. Sonic Mania Collector's Edition easily holds any tackle box. Made from a space-age polymer cardboard for years of family fun. Sonic Mania is humanely raised, free-range, and organic. And chefs love it, too. Mmm, look at that sizzle. Buy the Sonic Mania Collector's oh. Edition for the ultimate celebration of past and future. Sonic Mania Collector's Edition, available now for a limited time only. And cancel separately. Yep. All right, cool. See, you can see. Yay, testing. <laughs> Back to us blurry monkeys here. Love it. Okay, so <laughs> one of the cool things about that, and, and we do apologize if it's blurry, guys. This is this is run number one, so yeah. bear with us. Give us your feedback, please. We need all of it. Yeah, we wanted to hit the ground running as pure Sonic and, you know, make sure everything's working. We did do some test streams on, you know, offline, but we wanted to make sure everything looked good. Clearly, we are blurry. I am semi-transparent. Hey, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> cool. So so bear with us on, on some of that stuff, and we'll get it fixed up as we do actual streams yes. going forward. One of the cool things about that whole infomercial is that it, it came together very quickly. Um, and the really neat thing about that was that that scene with the egg, where they, they crack the egg on the side of the box, mm -hmm. the scene was actually scripted to be that he cracks the egg and then opens it on yep. the box. And it's like, oh, look at that sizzle. And the egg's not sizzling at all. Um, and the guy, the guy messed up as he was doing it. And he cracks the egg and completely fails it. And the egg like slides down the box and onto the counter. And we yep. just all died laughing as we were filming it. And we just decided to keep the scene because we thought it was so funny. Um, did you guys notice the t-shirts too? And, and notice it's... Also, shout outs to Papa Sega. How you doing, guys? Oh, Dad, don't watch our live stream. Dad, please. please. You're on, embarrassing man. us. All the cool kids are going to think we're lame now. Jeez, oh, not again. 
so those T-shirts that are are in there, we'll talk about those in a little bit too. Um, mm-hmm. You mean? <laughs> The no 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 I'm oh. not talking about oh. the, the Amazon I'm talking about oh. the Izuka-san fan club T-shirt which ah. was in there is yeah that's right <laughs> now <laughs> remember I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you guys if you would buy an Izuka-san fan club T-shirt a little bit later in the stream and I if you would I really need you to like show your support for this because sometimes we have cool ideas but some people may not want those ideas to become reality but with your help we might be able to make the reality. Guys. Looking at you, Internet. Yes, please help us out there. <laughs> I don't know what that could be in reference to. You'll have to wait and mm. see. Um, well, we're here today. We've got some cool Sonic Mania t-shirts on. Um, these guys would probably be interested in seeing Sonic Mania. So, Jay, I think we could fire up the game and maybe take a uh, playthrough through it? Maybe. I, I don't know. Chat doesn't seem like they really want it. Like, chat, would you actually like to... Someone says, yes, do it in all capitals. Yes, and do it in all capitals. I don't know if that's in reference to Mania or if that's in reference to something else. Mm. I see. I see. A make it happen. Make it happen. Yeah, lots. Someone says, "Please, we do." Please, we give do. Us. Okay. Yeah, there's there's a lot of yeses happening. There's a lot of yeses. Interesting. Hmm. But do we have mania here? Is the real question. I don't know if we do. All right. Well, we'll have to check it out then. <laughs> Some, someone says, "Do it for Harambe." Do it for Harambe. All right. Someone says, "Sonic Mega Collection." That we're not playing Mega Collection today. I'm Sorry, but like like we said, this is the test stream, so we figure out all the the problems, the kinks ah. of it. Oh, screen. Hi, OBS. All right. I know exactly what's going on there. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. It happened just during the testing stream. Oh, what's this? Aaron, what is this on, on our television screen? Oh man, I just I saw the background section there. That was beautiful. Yeah. Uh, okay. It looks section. like looks like we're live, guys. We're gonna take a quick look at Sonic Mania. As you guys know, Sonic Mania, uh, developed by Christian Whitehead and Simon Tomley and the awesome people over at Pagoda West. Uh, mm -hmm. The music um, by T. Lopes, who actually got his start doing a lot of fan music oh, for Sonic stuff. His remixes are all out there. It's pretty amazing. Yep. So the entire team that's working on this in association with Sega are all huge fans, and in my opinion, that's what makes it so cool. Um, now, you guys have seen Green Hill Zone a lot. Probably you have seen what all the other um, press sites have uploaded for Green Hill mm -hmm. Zone. So why don't we take a look through Studiopolis instead and kind of show you guys the new stuff. That, and I'm pretty sure you guys have seen Green Hill Zone for the last 25 years, and you're just like, I want to see Studiopolis. So let's do it. Cool. And there is a lot of new stuff in Green Hill Zone. It's important to note that, right? Like there's a, new, there's a new upper path. There's a new lower path. There's a ton of stuff in Green Hill Zone that you've never seen before, including that mini boss that was in the trailer mm -hmm. and people have played it at PAX and other shows. Yep. Look at these little animations Sonic does. It looks very reminiscent. And then, hey, let's go. The cool thing was we, when we were working on that, the render of that actually that we did for the 500,000 mm -hmm. uh, followers on Twitter, um, it was cool because it was still kind of early on that we had that created. And so it was neat watching that go from like sprite into a 3D render that was built. And I was like, I hope people will, will kind of catch the reference when we do it. And of course you guys did because, you know, that's how Sonic fans and the internet works. Yeah, we know. You guys are very meticulous. You guys already found some of the little Easter eggs inside our infomercial, but only some. All right, so Sergio, uh, I trust that you're going to play a lot better than some of the people that have uploaded videos of this, right? You're going to show uh, some of this stuff? I, I don't know if I can. Uh, I'm just an intern here, man. That, uh, that's all right. Just uh, don't die within the first 30 seconds to spikes, and I won't fire you just yet. All right. So Let's we're taking this. we're taking a look through the uh, the lower path right now. Um, Sonic Mania runs at 60 frames per second, which is awesome, especially if you like the classic games. Um, if you're like me and grew up with them, like Sergio, we, yeah. we both grew up with those games. And so seeing it at 60 frames is awesome, uh, and it feels just as good as it looks when you play through the game and like watch Sonic bouncing around and and going off the springs here. Only regrettable thing is I don't think Twitch is going to capture this at 60 frames. Oh, sadness. Uh, yeah. So you guys might be getting at 30, but we. We're not lying to you when we say it's a beautiful 60. Oh, look what you made me do, Aaron. I told you not to get hit by the spikes, man. Ah, but don't I'm not die. Dead. All I'm right, dead. don't die. Uh, what's this Eggman monitor do? So e <laughs> Eggman <laughs> boxes, <laughs> hopefully you guys know, Eggman boxes, they're not your friend. Yes, it's a box. It's a bad box. I it's like there boxes, to troll you. Though. That's right. Watch out for those. All right, let's give a shout out here to Vaudeville and Eggman. Look at that. Oh, that's wonderful. I love that animation. Very cool. The Sega Sonic popcorn shop is uh, one of my favorite references that they put in here because that's that's a real popcorn yeah. maker that was in Japan. Did you know it has curry flavor? Curry popcorn? Curry flavored popcorn. They do that in Japan? They do. Why? I don't know. Uh, okay. You can add, maybe you can ask our special guest later. I, I'll, <laughs> I'll admit, I it seems strange to me, but I would I, I would try I would try curry popcorn. 
Yeah. I have tried it. It's actually pretty Really? Yeah. Life, life experiences. Life experience. I guess. <laughs> da da da. Um, in the background here, you see uh, Club Spin, uh, a reference to Club Sega, actually, which is a real club mm. in Japan. If you go to those, they're actually like arcades. They're really cool arcades that Sega owns. Even the chat is like, Curry, like what? And who's the special guest? <laughs> who's the special guest? Oh! You'll have to wait and find out. Yeah. You'll have to wait and see. We're going to get to that in, uh, in just a little bit here. Oh. Now, I love this reference here with the Hornet van. This is really cool because that's a reference to Daytona USA. And if you have like a Sega Saturn or played it at the arcades, it's like that game bring ba brings back a lot of memories. It does. It makes you think of. Oh, no, 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 go back, go back, go back. Go back. Oh, what's this? Right down there, the TV. Yeah. Don't hit the spring. There. Okay, so the three colors on this TV, you guys probably noticed. Uh, it's a reference to the three colors on your Game Gear. Probably the only console ever created in the world that can go through 36 AA batteries in a 24 hour period. Yeah. Fun fact. You have to almost strap a nuclear power plant to your back to play it for more than 10 minutes. It was uh, it was quite a system, but it was in color, man. It was in full color. It was in full color. You can watch TV on it. With yeah. A special adapter. I had I had the uh, magnifying thing, like when you stick the magnifying thing on it. Yeah, it was awesome for car rides. All right, let's see if I can. Ah. Uh, okay, nice. so show off show off this guy here. This is one of my favorite badniks in the zone. Like, notice, okay, so do you see how he was, he was all, like determined and angry when he had the three orbs, and now that he's lost one of the orbs, he's kind of like, uh, I don't know how I'm feeling about this. And now that now he's down to one orb, and he's he's obviously a little bit distressed because he can't actually spin anymore and now he's just sad and shaking and and so this this robot let us deliver him his sweet and delivery of of deliveriness deliveriness because <laughs> i realized 10 out, of 10. 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 deliver him <laughs> all right let's put it on the package that was that was beautiful so that was <laughs> i know that was beautiful mm. so that robot kind of goes through this like range of emotions and i thought that was, was pretty neat yep let's do the big finish all right take us through the end yeah awesome so um that mania collector's edition um is confirmed for for North America, so U.S. and Canada, and mm -hmm. I guess it, if you can order it on Amazon, you're good to go, no yes. matter where you live. If it says you can order it, you do your thing. Um, yeah. Now it's coming out next year, mm -hmm. as we know, um, and we're going to show a lot more about it and talk about it um, as we go forward. And we are looking for kind of feedback from you guys about whether or not you want to see streams like this in the future, kind of what your interest would be. Mm. Obviously, we'll try to get a much better camera for focus and stuff like that. So this is what we've thrown together. Supersonic147 asks a very interesting question. What's that? Does Sonic like wasabi chili dogs? Wasabi? I would say so. I don't, I don't know. I mean, if good. you consider Sonic Unleashed, That's he has good. all these different hot dog types and he just scarfs them all down. That's a good question. Well, I'll tell you what, I think it's about time because because today's stream is going to be pretty short. We just mm -hmm. wanted to kind of test this out with an actual audience on the real channel and yes. see how the hardware is working. Uh, first and foremost, let's actually check on the audio. How, how do we sound, guys? So chat, we're asking you, is the audio sound uh -huh. good? Is it clear? Is it pretty crisp? We know that the picture is a little bit blurry. We yeah. want to find out on the audio right now. How do we sound? How do we sound? Dad, this is the part where you start sounding out yet again. We know you're watching down. Hi, Irvine. How you doing? Let's see here. Audio is perfect. OK, cool. Well, at least we got that. All right. Well, we'll take that. And we know the camera's blurry, so. Yeah, the camera no. is something that's going to take a little more tweaking. We have to kind of like mess with the chroma key. We know that part. It, cool. That's very, very annoying, surprisingly. Wow, there's over a thousand of you in here right now. Wow, and you're saying there's no buzz. <laughs> hey, that's a that's a success already. And, and no buzz. Well, I think it's about time we, we get our special guest. So yes. today, since we are talking about the infomercial, oh, do you have more of these? Where are these at? Where are these at? I don't know. Well, these, these, by the way, are probably my favorite plush uh, that our licensing team have made. They, they made these with Tommy, their classic Sonic plush. Where's mm -hmm. Tails? Tails is over there by the TV. He passed out. Go get him. All right. Here, have knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we call product placement, guys. Shamelessly These, chilling. these are actually pretty pretty great, though. Um, I think these are at Toys R Us now. I think they're in stock at they this are. point. So if you guys are interested hey. in, in actually getting these uh, limited edition plush that they made for the 25th anniversary, that's yeah, where you can get them. Just put them right here for you. Thanks, buddy. All right. Yeah, look at that. We, should, uh, we should probably go get our special guest now and bring oh. them in. All right. Let me, uh, let, me go, let me go grab them. All right. So... Well, keep this secret. Don't don't let, okay. let so, them see that. Okay. I'm not gonna let. Okay, so guys, guys. Well, Aaron runs out to go get our super special guest for today. I want you guys to do something. I want you guys to do something. Promise me you're gonna do it. So, we're thinking about the Izuka-san T-shirts. Our special guest is against it, staunchly against it. We want you guys to show your love. And right. you know, just sh 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 you know, sound out in the chat. Right. What? What? Okay. No, we're almost good. Hang on. Yeah, we're almost good. Just sound out in the chat when it happens. Okay. All right. So wait. What were you talking about? Oh, I, 
I can't tell you. That's between me and the chat. Oh man. All right. I hate when you guys so, do this. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Oh, is I'm that a scoot? Oh, I think we. Who's I, that? That's almost two special guests. Well, hey, oh. why don't you scoot over for just a second? No, I'll, I'll move over here. Okay, thanks, man. There you go. All right. Should we go back to maybe the, hmm. the full screen? For this one. Yeah. Full screen camera. That'd be great. Thanks, dude. All right. Okay, well guys, um, if you could, please, please welcome our very special guest uh, in full blurry vision, also joining us today uh, for the inaugural test stream. Uh, please give a warm welcome in Steam Chat to Izuka-san from Sonic Team. Come on in, man. Watch your step, have a seat. Yeah, it's a little crowded in here, right? Very crowded. <laughs> awesome. Now you can see, you can see what they're writing right down there. You can see that. Yep. Uh, hello. Now, now they're right up there. That's our camera <laughs> up top there. Oh, everyone's saying, hey, hello, Izuka-san. Oh, and wait, I think I think we have one more special guest. Why don't you come, come back? Oh, oh, oh my goodness. It's it's Hoshino-san from Sonic Team. And, and look, look at what we've got. <laughs> we've got Izuka-san fan club fans. No, <laughs> he's like, dude. Okay, so so true story. Um, we we actually made these fans. So so these t-shirts, these t-shirts were made in secret. Izuka-san had no idea we were making them for the infomercial. <laughs> he didn't even know they existed. And then when we showed the infomercial internally at Sega, Hoshino-san and a couple of his had these t-shirts on, and they had jackets on, and they like unzipped the jackets and then showed off the t-shirts. And Izuka, it was like priceless watching Izuka-san's face. In the lead up to that. Some of the girls in the office made these beautiful, absolutely beautiful <laughs> Izuka-san fan club fans. And we hid them in the office. Like, we put them in pretty open spots just to see if Izuka-san would notice. And I don't, you don't, I don't think you noticed, did you? No, I don't know. <laughs> so, guys, I, I hate to jump in right now. The What's chat up? is going crazy saying, hello, Izuka-san. Hello, Hoshina-san. And they're wondering, where can I get that Izuka-san fan club t-shirt? <laughs> they legit want the t-shirt. It's cool. not for sale. <laughs> but... But Izuka-san, if the fans really want it, what if we could like tie it in with a charity or you know yeah, find no. find some way to help people out with your face on a T-shirt? That's that's special, man. No. <laughs> see, what I have, see, this is what I have to get through, guys. Well, let's see, let's. Yeah, okay, why don't we take a vote in chat? Chat. I need you to, to tell us whether or not you would want one of these shirts. If you'd buy it, so Izuka-san can see your answers live right here in chat. Yes, the shirt. Well, okay, so I want you to read this chat right now, Izuka-san. Look at this. Look at this. There's over a thousand people in here right now, and they're almost all saying they want your face on a T-shirt. Oh. They want the Izuka-san fan club shirt. No, no, nobody wants. No, <laughs> nobody yes, they wants to yes, they do. Look at this, man. Look at this. Yes, 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 yes. Someone said yes with like 12 E's in it. That's a lot of vowels. That, they'd buy like at least three shirts. Yes. <laughs> Fantastic. It's so good, Hoshino-san. Now, Hoshino-san, can you tell us, um, before we're actually, I'm gonna actually ask you some real questions in a second. So okay. th thanks for bearing with me, <laughs> yes. I promise. Um, can you tell us, Hoshino-san, who was it that made those beautiful t-shirts? Who designed those? Me. <laughs> Sonic Team approved. <laughs> there you have it. The t-shirts were actually designed about 12 hours before we shot by Hoshino-san himself. He sat here in the office and photoshopped Izuka-san's face from other photos onto the t-shirts. The cool thing is there are three different t-shirts. You will notice this if you freeze frame the infomercial. In the beginning, there's Izuka-san and he's, he does not have a big smile. And as, as it progressively goes forward, Izuka-san gets more and more happy by the end of the infomercial until in the final shot when, when Hoshino-san's holding the box up, um, yeah. It's like the big grin. So, so this progression. There's like an Easter egg progression. <laughs> Look at us. Do you really think we don't want you on a T-shirt? <laughs> See, I'm telling you, Izuka-san. I'm telling you, man. We should strongly consider no this way. for the future. I, I think so. I think so. Well, Izuka-san, Hoshino-san, you guys are living here in the states now. Yeah. Right. You came all the way over from Japan to work here in the states with the the Sega team here. What's what's that been like? Kind of like moving from Japan back to the U.S. Because because you guys used to be here before, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How, how's it been getting used to that? How do you plan? What's that? Yeah, it's difficult. It's, it's hard. It's challenging, yeah? <laughs> it's difficult to answer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> to totally understandable. <laughs> and let's let's talk about then Sonic Mania for just a second, too. Yep. Um, so we showed off Studiopolis um, really quickly here. People are pretty excited for the game. Anything um, that you want to say or comment about Sonic Mania for all the people that are looking forward to it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, really. Like. 
you know, because we know we know that it's got old zones and uh -huh. new zones, right? Yeah. Yes. yes. Um, are, are there other surprises that are planned for the game that we don't know about yet? Uh, yes. Uh, we already bring uh, so classic some some of classic stages from Sonic One, Two, Three, and Knuckles and mm -hmm. CD. Right. And also we have uh, brand new stages. Yeah. Awesome. So so maybe we're gonna see more about the the. Classic levels returning and the brand new stages. What do you mm -hmm. think? Will we see any by the end of this year? We're going to see some more. Uh, Maybe. I'm not sure, but, but stay tuned. Awesome. So we will update. Chad is wondering, will there be a demo? Oh, uh, will there be a demo of the game? Mm. Demo. I wow. I haven't heard any news on on a like a demo on PSN or PC or anything yet. I don't. Have right. You? I don't think so. Right. Nothing yet, guys. Mm -hmm. yeah. Nothing yet. No. Nothing yet. It's no, a good question. Not enough yet. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's get some more questions for Izuka-san and Hoshino-san while we've got them here. Right, we're going to be a little bit behind here, so feel free to ask another question yourself, Aaron, because there are okay. a bit of a chat lag here. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, chat. You know how the lag works with Twitch. Um, Hoshino-san, I have to ask. That that fan, it says, it's. does it say love on it? It's <laughs> more, more easy. <laughs> He's like a sign in Japanese. He's like, that's enough. That's enough. Like, don't, don't show this fan anymore. Stop embarrassing me live on stream in front of all these people, Aaron and Hoshino-san. Stop that, man. I, you know, I, oh, you have, you have a question. Yeah, I got one from the chat. So, will there be more new levels than old? Is that something we are prepared to talk mm, about? I, I don't think uh -huh. we are ready to, to mm. comment on what the ratio is. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Not yet. Uh, I think so. So, classic level is uh, more than. New levels. Mm -hmm. So maybe, but but like uh, yeah, classic levels, uh, all classic levels with uh, reimagined, so redesigned for the mania. And so, so, so it, the, it feels like, feels like a new stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think it's an important thing to note. Like when you say like we might see classic levels coming back, we're not actually seeing the green hill that we remember mm -hmm. or the other levels that we remember. We're seeing a totally different take on it. Yes. We get to the end of an act and we see a totally different mini boss that we've never seen before. Yeah. So in reality, it's sort of like brand new areas and old levels in a new, a really new way. Yes. Also, awesome. we have a lot of so surprise so gimmick and, and more the stage. And more surprises that yeah. we don't know about yet. All right. It's pretty fun. All right. Excited for that. Next Good. one is, will there be any new obscure characters appearing in the game? Any obscure characters? So mm. Are we talking like, like, like Mighty Fang, the Armadillo? Fang, Fang the Sniper, uh, Ray the Flying Squirrel, those guys. You know, the ones that were like the, one the shots. missing. They were like on the, the missing, missing posters in, <laughs> missing in uh, Generations. <laughs> the missing links. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I don't think there's any news on, on those guys. Just just the big three right now, yeah? Mm. Just Sonic, uh, Tails, and Knuckles right now, yeah? Yes, yeah, play, playable character is only yeah, three characters. Okay. okay, awesome. Good to know. Cool. Uh, will there be Super Emeralds in the game as time on extremes? Ooh, mm. super, super Emeralds. Mm. No, I, I don't think so. So, uh, but uh, there's a new item. Uh, there's a new item in the Sonic Mania. Oh, and then maybe we'll find out what that new item is oh, later, yeah? Yes. Yeah, not on us yet. Oh, okay. 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 So, okay. Something to look forward to, guys. You're teasing the stream now. You're like, we got new stuff. I can't tell you what it is, but <laughs> trust me, it's in there. It's pretty cool. Please look forward to it. <laughs> awesome. Let's take uh, let's take one or two more questions, and then we'll uh, then we'll, we'll have to sign off for the test stream. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, are they going to turn Tails into a robot, and will it be horrible? That's something along your line, Aaron. <laughs> uh, listen, guys, I, I hate to tell you this, um, but un unfortunately, uh, Tails is going to be lost in the next major Sonic title. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That's not true at all. That's not true. Actually, every every time we have a major Sonic game come up, I start the rumor that, that Tails is somehow like horribly lost, and, and we don't know what happens to him. Um, Tails as a robot, Izuka-san, Hoshino-san, yes, no, no, in Mania, no, no. <laughs> it's, it's a laugh and a resounding no, we're not, we're not no. turning into a robot. Okay, and th this one's not so much Mania, but they're curious about it, when will we hear more about Sonic 2017? Oh, yeah, that's oh. a good, that's a good question. That's a good ender. Yeah, 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 so people are curious about Sonic 2017. Um, I don't, I don't know if there's a date that we can give them just yet, right? But we kind of want them to just stay tuned and... Yeah, yes, yeah. Uh, and and so you guys, project 2017 yeah. is so coming from the holiday 2017. It, it, so it is just it's a, it's over a year away. <laughs> is what, be patient, uh, and you guys are, are working hard on it right now. Mm -hmm. uh, at the same time too, as, as well as on Sonic Mania with Christian and Simon and Pagoda West. So, so stay tuned, guys, for for 2017. It's probably still a ways out that we'll have more info on that. 
Um, but this has kind of been our first inaugural test stream. So we'd like to say thank you to all the people in the chat. One thing we'd like to, to end with, actually, we just want to kind of get a read on this. We know that the camera is blurry. Uh, sounds like the audio is better. Great. <laughs> we've, we've got Hoshino-san with his beautiful t-shirt here, which we love. <laughs> We're curious if you guys would be interested in seeing more stuff like this, which is kind of a behind the scenes look at what happens here at Sega in the Sonic office. Uh, maybe hearing kind of the fun stories um, that we've got to share. Um, would you want to see this on a more regular basis? Um, if yes, put something in chat, let us know. Um, if you're not interested at all, well, yeah, just just don't say anything. It's okay. We still love you. Uh, chat is already blowing up with a bunch of yeses, and I love you guys. Aww. Aww. <laughs> so I like okay. someone put hearts in there. <laughs> Whoever put hearts, you're the best. You're the best, man. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Or girl, it's all good. Well, Izuka-san, thank you so much for thank joining you. us on the stream. Yes. And Hoshino-san, seriously, phenomenal job with those t-shirts. <laughs> like that is the best. And I just I just want to point out. We have this recorded, right? So we can see all those answers. And Izuka-san, we're going to go through, we're going to count those answers. We're going to count how many yeses there were. And I think if there's over like 500 or 1,000 yeses, we, we should strongly consider selling that well, limited time or something, you know, like selling this t-shirt. I'm just saying. 70% to charity? I'm just I'm just saying consider it. You could, you could help a lot of people, Izuka-san. No, no. <laughs> nobody, nobody want to buy that Yes, no, no, they do. <laughs> That's only my mom and dad. <laughs> Izu, you heard it here first, guys. Izuka-san's mom and dad have created over a thousand alternate Twitch accounts, and they are spamming our Twitch chat right now, saying that they want to buy Izuka-san t-shirts. You have some crafty parents, man. I, have, I gotta hand it to your parents. They are internet savvy. Well done to Izuka-san's mom and dad out there in chat right now. Thank you guys all very much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for all of your feedback you. and for bearing with us. And we'll talk to you guys Bye. another time. Have a great week, guys. And we hope you enjoyed the infomercial. Mm -hmm. All right, stand all right, by. Stand you. by. We're still live for a second. Oh. <laughs> Farewell, Bye. everybody. Goodbye.